the Hawks Marine bioregional assessment process is a very important one and this is the time to push a marine park for the entire region. Marine parks, no-take areas especially like Cabbage Tree Bay, have a real role in protecting fish populations from fishing and other exploitative activities. Things like blue groper, if you go inside one of these parks, you'll see much larger individuals. And the behaviour of fish in marine parks is much more akin to a natural, unfished environment. All of the marine parks in New South Wales are mostly open to fishing and pretty much open to all recreational activities. It's just we have certain areas that we put aside that are important to protect so that fish can grow and develop. If we don't allow fish to grow to full size, then they're not able to breed. It's the really big fish that produce most of the eggs and therefore many more baby fish, which then produces the fish supplies for the future. Weedy sea dragons are loved by people, not just locals, but people come from around the world to dive in Sydney to see these creatures. We're worried that kelp is disappearing here in Sydney, so if it disappears, the weedy sea dragons will disappear. For many years, we've talked about wanting to protect our coastal lifestyle better than we have in the past. Right now, the government is saying to people, what do you want? but it might just be a once-in-a-generation opportunity. So, have your say.